next grammar point is expressing have in Hindi with the postposition ke pas. As you know that Hindi does not have the verb have. Hindi has different ways of expressing the meaning of the verb have. In the second lesson, we learned how to express the verb have for familial relations. Hindi uses possessive pronouns to express the familial relations. I have a brother would be mera ek bhai hai. We have a daughter would be hamari ek beti hai. Let's now learn how to express have with concrete and transferable objects. The postposition ke pas is used to express the verb have for concrete objects. It can be understood as in someone's possession. So Mohan ke pas would mean in Mohan's possession. And that in fact means Mohan has. Let's take some examples. Mohan ke pas gaadi hai. Mohan has a car. Us ladke ke pas nai cycle thi. The boy had a new bike. Cycle is feminine. It is past tense. So the verb is thi. Meri behen ke pas do kitabe thi. My sister had two books. Again, it is the past tense and feminine plural subject. So the verb is thi. Mere bhai ke pas ek chota radio tha. My brother had a small radio. Pratima ke pas do baste the. Pratima had two bags. Since ke pas is a compound postposition, it will go with a possessive pronoun. So I have, you have, she has, we have, etc. would be mere paas, aapke paas, uske paas, hamare paas, etc. Mere paas paise nahi hai, I don't have money. Pahle uske paas ek bada ghar tha. He had a big house before. It is the past as sentence, ghar tha, he had a house. Ghar is masculine, so it is tha. हमारे पास तुम्हारी किताब नहीं थी वी डिड नॉट हैव योर बुक तुम्हारे पास कुछ नहीं है यू डोंट हैव एनीथिंग